Scotland the Brave. Love that song. Love Scotland. I'm Finbar, Finbar Bass. Cooked up some uh, free bass lessons for you if you want to click on the little clicker right down there. No hay problema. And um, thanks for listening and let's roll right up into this one. You're going to start off on the 12th fret of the D string with two notes. Then 14th and then 16th. Back to the 12th. Then you got the 16th, right? And then the 14th of the uh, G string. Right? Then you're going to slide up to the 19th fret. And you don't have to slide, you can just hit it, but I like to slide it. Right? You're going to hit that 19th twice, then the 18th. Then the 19th again. Then go back to the 14th. So, so far. Right? <laughs> then you're going to hit the um, 16th fret of the um, of the D string. And then you're going to follow this pattern. 16th of the D. Then you're going to go to the 12th. Then you're going to go to the 12th of the G. And then 16th of the G. Right? So far. Right? Then you're going to hit the 12th fret of the um, G string, followed by the 16th fret of the D, and then the 14th fret of the, um, of the G. Right? Then you're gonna hit. Then you're gonna hit the uh, 16th. This is all on the D string. 16th, followed by the 12th, followed by the 14th. So so far. And then you're gonna do this little ditty here, where you're gonna go to the uh, 14th fret of the G string. So it was. And you're going to go. And that, run, that runs it right back into the beginning again. So what that is, is you're going to be playing on the 14th fret, followed by the 16th, back to the 14th, the 12th. That's all on the G string. And then on the D string, you're going to go back to the 16th and then the uh, 14th. And then that repeats. It repeats all the way to there. And when you get to that point, it changes a little bit. You're not going to do this little run that I showed you. You're just going to play the 12th, the 14th, and then the 12th, and then the 16th of the D string. Right? And after that, you're going to go right to the 14th fret of the uh, G string, and then you're going to slide up again. Now it looks like this. So, and <clears throat> then they play um, a series of with um, varying things in between. So what you're going to do the first time is you're just going to do a and then you're going to hit the 16th fret of the D string followed by the fourth, uh, I'm sorry, 12th fret of the D string. So it's going to look like this. Right? Slide back up. What that one is, is go back to the 14th fret of the um, G string followed by the 16th fret of the D, 14th fret of the G. So, so far. Then what you're going to do, you're going to hit two notes on the 19th fret. Then you're going to go down to the 18th fret. Oh, 18th fret. <clears throat> so, and you're going to play that pattern a couple times. You're going to play 19, 19, 18, 16. Then just 19, 18, 16. And then one more time. So the whole phrasing is... Back 
back to the 14th, back to the 12th, then back to the uh, 16th of the D, 14th and then 12th. So the whole thing is going to look like this. And that brings you back into the beginning. All right, Scotland the Brave. Love those traditional Celtic songs. I love the, uh, you know, Scottish, Irish, Welsh, whatever it is. Super fun to play on bass. Um, thank you so much for listening. I've uh, cooked up some free bass lessons for you if you want to click on the little YouTube clicker box right down there. Um, thank you so much, and as always, have fun with those.